Hey, this is Riptiron, and I'm on the DerpaCraft server. And I thought I'd introduce you to something new we've been doing. All right. Well, me and Oz here, uh, after killing the Wither, um, we've been doing ourselves a little strip mining because we set the beacon up right down here and we've got it set to haste and it is amazing we cleared all this in less than 30 minutes um, mm -hmm. and not long after <laughs> this is why we did this and uh, I'm sure that everybody's watched uh, you know Seth Bling and Etho tell everybody, you know, strip mining is for chumps. Well, we're believers in that now. Yeah, we second that. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. So get yourself out to the uh, nether, get yourself some skulls, set up a beacon down here on level 12, and just have a field day. <laughs> but you do need a level uh, uh, efficiency 5 pick um, helps if it's unbreaking because the, you do go through them rather quickly um, but yeah this is this is this is just a ton of fun so you guys enjoy okay a little update on our mining I'm standing here by the beacon which is giving me sky access which means down here we can see forever now and as you can see, before I get, there's where it goes away. <laughs> um, we have not picked away any of the resources yet, just to show how frequent they are. And anybody who's flown around an MC edit uh, will be able to see kind of the frequency of all these resources. But it is kind of neat to look at them, you know like this because it is quite amazing there's some diamond over there there's a pit with diamond in it right there and there's, diamond over here and we have just found more diamond I mean this is literally less than an hour's worth of work and we're coming up with just tons of resources uh, yeah strip mining's you know shaft For mining chance. Shaft mining. Shaft mining's for chumps. This open strip pit, you know, this this is the way to go. <laughs> you know, yeah. I think we're clearing this faster than a wither could, and that says quite a bit. Yeah, yeah, we're we're definitely, you know, definitely. I've already gone through a pulp pick. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to stop myself. <laughs> um, I'm out of range, but yeah, we've pretty much done a quarter of the beacons range now we're gonna go over on this other half see we've done everything on this quarter and now we're gonna start this other quarter and it's just fast as you can shake a stick at it and if you go at the right speed you won't break your resources but that's kind of a artistic you know feel for how to do that I feel like I'm painting <laughs> Yeah, it is kind of like a brush in Photoshop, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. And this, this just goes really quick. Really quick. Yeah, and plus we also got that bonus of you have a slime farm now. <laughs> yeah, now, now I have a slime farm. Instant slime farm, you know? <laughs> yeah. It's, it's just kind of one of the benefits of doing things this way um, tips tips on doing this uh, make sure that you have torches and you're gonna have plenty of uh, the only thing you won't get out of this is wood so bring a bring at least a stack of wood just to make sticks so you can torch as you go uh, that's probably gonna be the most important thing also bring yourself like I'd say at least eight eight of these uh, chests because 
these two chests are already full of cobble on just a quarter. Oh my goodness. Yeah, uh, yeah and um, we haven't picked the resources yet, but that's all the dirt we've got. It's not a whole lot of dirt, but the cobble is definitely adding up really quick. So you're going to need chests and you're going to need to set yourself up with a place for them. And uh, then basically, uh, you know, have fun <laughs> because this is a blast, let me tell you. Just being able, oh, look over here, there's some more. <laughs> more diamond. Wow, go figure. Oh, you got more? No, I'm oh. just saying that's oh. kind of how it goes. Get my hopes up like that, man. I'm gonna beat you. They have to turn the regen on. Who dug this hole downward? Ah, <laughs> uh, that was probably me. Whenever I, eh, <laughs> I was I was inexperienced. Um, yeah, that's another thing. Resist the urge to dig down, because when you do, uh, you end up. I'm gonna put a torch down there if I can. There we go. When you dig down, you basically are uh, undermining your floor. And you want to keep it as flat as possible because after you do this, you're going to go down a level. And you're going to you're going to do the same thing one level below where you're at and one level above where you're at. And that way you'll cover the entire area. <laughs> Um, yeah, and it does, it really does help to have a pal helping you out, and then you can just split, split what you find, and then you can go over to his base and do the same thing there, and then, you yeah, know, because, have a base first. well, uh, one of the biggest reasons is it helps to have two people working on picks. Good Lord, got a fortune shovel? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I told you earlier. I hope you don't want any gravel because you ain't getting nothing from me. What do we do with all this flint, man? Maybe maybe we shouldn't uh, use the the fortune shovel because gravel, what are you going to do? You're going to make like a hundred of those flints and just leave them in every chest we leave in the nether? <laughs> I was thinking uh, Is there use the... Use the iron farm and just go uh, Zisto on everybody and light everything on fire all day. <laughs> well, that's, you know, you know, I'm gonna use that in our in our PVP. <laughs> I'm gonna just I'm gonna come in equipped with a lighter and I'm just gonna click 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 click. <laughs> you know what? That's great. We should do that. Maybe <laughs> maybe that's uh, something we should specify in the death games. Oh, I could do like an we'll do a flint. Flint fire off. Yeah, we'll do like a wood house and you know wood floor with a where it's like a solid drop two hundred blocks. Or wool. And that's that. What's that? Oh, wool. Oh, even better. Yeah. So then we just light fires, light fires, light fires. <laughs> make it make it like four or five levels high, and they start yeah. on the top level. And oh, that's that's great. And yeah, then and cool. then uh, you know the bottom <laughs> level is over lava. <laughs> You know, like six bo blocks above lava, so it won't catch fire. But yeah, that, that's something. Um, anyway, yeah, we're having fun down here, bouncing ideas, skyping. You know, it's the typical Minecraft experience. So that's right. We are derping it up here on the Derpercraft <laughs> service server. Um, anyway, I'll update you a little later. But yep, we're having fun. <laughs> Oh, um, oh, Lord, this is crazy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> right now, I'm working on redstone. <laughs> Even as I pass by, you know, other resources. It's just, oh, darn, I'm full. Okay. Uh, so let's, let's go see just if I have enough. Thinking I can get out this way. I don't know. God, this this has become a problem. Um, getting around down here is really, <laughs> really is a problem. 
Uh, yeah, here we are. Okay. Yeah. Ah, oh, there's my mushroom. Yeah, that's that's free base food right there. <laughs> I love this because um uh, oh get away. Where did you come from? Man, I guess he spawns somewhere over there. Uh you gotta watch out when you're mining this much space, um you really do have to become a fanatic about torching things. Uh, but let me get some of this coal out of my way. Uh, free up my inventory. Because, you know, I thought y'all might want to see that little click right there. Because that's, that's definitely some power when it comes to moving things around. Let's see. Yeah, 32 more. Bada bing. And eh, 13. Okay. That's how we do it. All right. And I believe, I believe, yeah. Yeah, I believe I might have enough. That's 40. Do I have it? Three. Yes, I do. All right. Now this, this is truly powerful. <laughs> this is, this is just nuts because that right there, that right there is crazy. <laughs> that, I'm, I'm just going to leave that one alone. On top of what we already got. <laughs> and I'll just put this off to the side there. Uh, cobble. Uh, cobble. There we go. I never know. <laughs> it's hard to tell. I mean, cobble, 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 cobble. <laughs> That's just retarded. Okay, now, what am I going for this time? Uh, there's, a, there's a lot, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff that we've gotten out of here. Yeah, this area right here needs digging up. And this nice little amount of gold right here. I I don't think we're going to have a problem as far as resources go. Um, we've been basically taking this place out for all it's worth and we're going down to bedrock here let me just show you which isn't very far away it's it's right down there yeah so it won't be long before this place is gone we'll have it all the way down and uh, Osrith had to go, or he'd still be out here with me. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't. Clear this back so we can see the beacon a little more clearly. It looks like I've got another layer to go before I reach the bedrock. I could probably squeeze another layer in there which is good. Want to save on my picks a little bit. But anyway, yeah, life life is good. Life is good cuz we're we're clearing a lot of a lot of blocks here. And uh, if you haven't discovered the wonders of mine beacon, 
or beacon mining, <laughs> it's time you started. Because <laughs> that's the one reason you want to get a beacon. Is to do this. Yep. I'm telling you. It's where it's at. It's the wave of the future. Anyway. Yep. <laughs>